Do not joke with this. He may miss it and the whole optics will get in his face. If you have to, behave like a coward, run away, but do not break this rifle. You didn't want to sell it to me years ago. No, there is no way for this rifle to be out of my hands. No way. Peter, can you shoot with this one? I do. So far in the series, we have seen several hunting situations in which hunters and boars took part, and there were even several killed wild boars. We saw early luck in the foggy morning-driven hunt. We heard the stories of the hunter who experienced a near miss with the wild boars. Now we will embark on dizzy-driven hunts together with the drivers and dogs. We will see, from an unusual point of view, the way the hunter perceives his target. We will take part on a difficult march through the fallen trees and the interweaving shrubs to push out the packs of wild boars resting there. Will the hunters take the hunting opportunity? We will find out in the next few minutes. We will bear witness to an impossible shot in total darkness. Will Archie manage to kill the huge boar thanks to a piece of wood and two nails? We will find out soon in a fascinating broadcast of Boars and Hunters. Make yourselves comfortable because the most interesting in Boars and Hunters is yet to come.